we're going to keep the keep the TV, keep that fireplace yeah. there. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. So we've got a we've got all the power supplies here. Yeah. Right. So we're going to get to have the power supply to the island. We're going to have our island to take these up. Yeah. And have a have a socket built in the. In yeah, built in the island. island yeah, to get but, a sort of connection to all the LED lighting. But trouble is, maybe the floor will come up quite easily. But yeah, yeah. yeah, it could be. Yeah, we could try a nice carpet go from here to here. Yeah. So maybe if um, the cable comes over, we put the carpet over the top of it. Yeah. So what we've got is we've got two recessed units. Yeah. This section here and this section here, which yeah. is in the super mat touch here. Yeah. Then we've got the actual other housing coming out. Which so we're so going what's this? What's this? What's this made out of here? And so it's so it's going to start from what the island would be. Around how many distance that was? Kept it 1.5. Yeah. From here. Yeah. And is that the same from this side here? No, 1.5. No, no. uh -huh. And then yeah. 1.5 from here to walk around, which yeah. is sort of normal, normal sort of walking area around yeah. an island, 1.5. Yeah. And then you've got a little seating yeah. area which will come off of the island. Yeah. Where people can sit, we've allowed two seats. Yeah. We've got a USB a flip socket in there so you can work from it, so there's yeah. a working station as well. Yeah. You know, so it's almost you know fully functional. Yeah. Island in the respect that in the morning you could have your coffee on this yeah. side of the island. Well, I think it's a very good idea. So if we've got clients coming in, yeah. and we can sit them down there, they can have a coffee. And all yeah. The rest of it. Yeah. It's per perfect. Yeah. And so, yeah. We've got a bit of room on this table here yeah. where the where the flower yeah. is, so we and could we can this could this could all go over. Yeah, we should go over at least a meter here, yeah. which would allow the walkway we would require to go around a little. Yeah. So these lights here, yeah, we're gonna have to. Uh, what we could do is put something from this. If you could get power to here, or we could have two nice. Yeah, that, that's what I would, I would just use yeah. the existing yeah. supply there. Yeah, and then we'll have the Alika downdraft, which is a four-pin induction, which actually has the extractor built inside it. Really? Yeah. Well, and that on that hob? Yeah, on that hob. So wow. you're doing two things. So at does, once. It, does it come out? Come out of the No, it's actually built in. Right. Built in the hot base. You see what's yeah. in and then it's built inside because the ones that come out the back incorporate yeah. more space in the island, yeah. which people want more sort of um, you know, sitting space around there. So this is what this provides. And then above it as well, yeah. you know, you can put a nice light in there rather than having a you know sort of extractor coming what, down. What's this kit what's this kitchen called in, in your So this is a touch range. This so is this, a touch range. Yeah, so this right. is touch. This is a super matte black. Yeah. And we've got the um, bronze work top on top of it. Yeah. And then we've obviously, yeah. you know, covered it with all, all the LEDs. And so then we've got a marble laminate which will go over the top yeah. of the breakfast. What, well. kind, what kind of marble is that? What, what, this what is just, just what we've supplied here. It's just a normal laminated yeah. work top. Yeah. Obviously, a lot of people would want to go for the solid options, yeah. but it just shows the quality of our yeah. laminates compared to yeah. other, you know, companies yeah. coming from Germany. Yeah. So what um, is it? Is this what? What's this? Is this going to be? A, a so this is this is a HPL material, which yeah. is more condensed MDF basically. Yeah. So another alternative yeah. to give it a lovely finish. Yeah. Out of a sort of cheaper alternative, but yeah. people will go for the solid sort yeah. of service more, more than likely. Yeah. But just you know, the combination works really well with the colours we've selected. So if that was a if that was a solid marble work, yeah. Top, would that go up another sort of five k? Yeah, well, depending on the size and yeah. the, the, you know the depth of what you require, it yeah, another three to five. Yeah, yeah. Okay. yeah. So it's just, it's just cool. And in the, um, the the kitchen range, yeah, which we've been sort of obviously yeah. working together yeah. on. How many ranges are there in the in the actual? So we got range? nine. We got nine ranges. Yeah. In the nine ranges, we offer different colours in each range. So yeah. each range might have four different colours. Touch yeah. has got five colours in it, yeah. so in total you've got about fifty-two door yeah. colours. Yeah. So in the in the brochure, which yeah. we will be using, yeah. there's, oh, there's five different ranges of kitchen. So you've got nine different ranges, nine, nine different, nine different ranges, nine different ranges, yeah. but inside the ranges you've got about four or five different coloured doors in right. that range. Right. Right. Okay. And they start off from a price group one, yeah. and they work their way up to so a price group nine. There's um, mainly there. A contemporary, aren't they? Yeah, contemporary. But there, there is some traditional. Yeah, no, yeah, style. yeah, yeah. We have got shaker style, which yeah. looks more contemporary. So you're yeah. bringing both into both, really. Yeah. You know, so you're trying to mix a bit modern and traditional, which works yeah. really well. Yeah. And um, 
on uh, so your standard delivery of yeah. these kitchens are five to six weeks yeah five to six weeks everything gets bespoke made yeah. for the individual client so it doesn't yeah. get picked off the shelf yeah. so the kitchens will actually be bespoke made so when yeah. it comes from germany yeah distribute twice in five weeks yeah you can see that's you know it's exactly. you know, good for timing so um the manufacturer yeah they are the biggest in the world aren't they yeah they're the biggest they're the leading in the world yeah, yeah. so they're uh, so yeah. number one I think I looked on that they turn over 1.4 billion. Yeah, exactly. Euros. About, right. Yeah, euros. Yeah. So, so they're mammoth. So you know, with what we request, you know, we get it to the timing that the client wants exactly. in the end. So the client, our new project's client, they're yeah. going to know if they team, they, they're going to be yeah. buying one of our branded kitchens. Yes. Yeah. It's coming from the biggest yeah. kitchen manufacturer in the world. In the world. Yeah. So that helps. But that's very it. important to us. We, we, we yeah. want to make sure when we offer one of our kitchens to a client. Yeah. They're going to get our first class delivery, delivery of the kitchen, yeah. and the quality yeah. is going to be fantastic. fantastic yes. and it all depends whether their budget is going to be 10 grand, yeah. 20 grand, 30 grand, 40 yeah. grand. It doesn't matter yeah. because we can upgrade the materials, materials the work yeah. surfaces, the, the, yeah. the, the, the taps, the ovens, whatever. Yeah, the work, yeah, like you said, to, to what the client sort of requires. So, yeah, it's, it's good because we can sort of go from one end to the other end. So, we can sort of, you know. Yeah. Oh, I, think, I, I, think, uh, I think their uh, manufacturing techniques yes. and their sort of delivery time yes. to work really, really well with what our clients sort of expect. Yeah. And um, I think in, in the range, yeah. there's so many different types of looks. Looks, yeah. There's a kitchen for everyone. Yeah, exactly. And not everyone in our, not every, all of our clients in yeah. Fulham, Chelsea, they, you know, listen, the market's not great and they yeah. don't want to spend. 50 to 100 yeah. in the kitchen. Yeah, exactly. So, you know, when I speak to my clients, that they've all got maybe 20 to 30 grand put aside yeah. for their kitchen. So yeah. that really gets them in yeah. our price range. Yeah, price range. Yeah. Right, yeah. And they're going to get, you know, obviously the design and build package. Yeah, we, yeah, we so it's not only everything the kitchens, in house, aren't we? We're doing the design, yeah. we're doing the kitchens, we're doing the construction, yeah. everything. Down to the installation yeah. of the kitchen. Like you said, we've got a big old unit ourselves over this side, so we can also hold the kitchens when you know the client needs it for, so we give them the time schedule of when it's going to be done by. Yeah. But we have got somewhere to sort of you know in house keep yeah. the kitchens as well. So. Well, it's going to be a good partnership, mate. Yeah. Yeah. Thank well. yeah, you. Excellent. Cheers. Display. So windows, apparel kitchens with Nobilia, so collaborating with Marco who's got the uh, license to sell uh, Nobilia in the UK. They will be um, supplying and fitting our branded kitchens to our clients. So there's, I think there's 10 kitchens in the range and uh, so, and the starting point, the price point is not expensive. You know, these are these are these are high quality, high end kitchens, but at really affordable prices. And we're not looking to bung on huge amounts of margin. We just want to we just want to control the sale because usually the client goes to their local Fulham kitchen designing company, and they're going to be talked into spending thirty to forty k. That's a ridiculous price. So today, I haven't been in the office. I've popped over to Reading to the kitchen distributor and I have viewed the most beautiful kitchens for our new range and I am so excited. So these kitchens are going to be offered to our clients uh, and also to anyone else out there looking for a new kitchen. Um, they are made in Germany in one of the biggest manufacturing factories in Europe uh, by Nubilia. Uh, they turn over 1.5 billion euros a year and we are lucky enough to have them manufacture our kitchens. If anyone out there is looking for a new kitchen, please do not hesitate for one minute to get in contact with me or my office on 020 7731 6841 for more information.
we are a design and build construction company, but now we are offering our clients luxury German kitchens. We have teamed up with a company called Nobilia. They are the biggest manufacturer of kitchens in Europe. They turn over 1.5 billion euros a year in kitchens. They supply all the high street brands, all the ones you see and you pay fortunes for, they just all get supplied and manufactured by Nobilia in Germany. So we're luckily gonna be teaming up with Nobilia to supply our luxury kitchens. Our competition are like the high street shops in Fulham or, or in Chelsea. You can't get a kitchen for less than 30K, it'd be even 40. Now our kitchen's gonna be starting from 14,995 pounds.